here in Chicago, Illinois, for our main event of the evening. Ten rounds among heavyweights. Each man comes into this fight supremely confident, expecting to deliver a W. And his opponent across the ring, hailing out of Beaufort, Smokin' Joe! Ten rounds slated in the books tonight. Here's the first. He comes back with the left hand again. Joe's not that shy about bringing it early on, but what can we expect here? Bringing it early on. <laughs> that's exactly what you're going to expect, and that's what you're going to get. Oh, and he's got something for him himself, and it's a left hand. Targeting that head with the combination punching. We are underway here, and we've heard from everybody that speed is going to be the big factor. Tyson's got it. Plenty of it. Yeah, now it's up to his opponent to come up with something. Maybe go to the body, take it away, slow him down. And he's really doing a nice job of hitting the mark with the jab. And that's exactly what he needs. And it's not hard to hit the mark when the mark's coming at you. The right choice of a punch. See, the defense pays off as he gets rid of that downstairs. Dismisses his opponent's headshot. Oh, good exchange there. 90 seconds to go here in this round. His opponent wanted the body. He wouldn't give it to him. Mike Tyson's showing you that sublime skill right now with that two-punch combo. Big left hand from Iron Mike. The double jab up top. A headshot block. Tyson's hit by a right hand. You're okay. Stay with me here. Hit the body. Tyson was hurt. Now Tyson looks to have his feet back underneath him. Yeah, but does he have his mind right? is he's still going to be the seek-and-destroy fighter that he's been before. Joe Frazier lands a big left hand. Tyson's putting forth a great combination there. Trying to time that straight left hand, and he does so with ease. And this round comes to an end. Joe Tessitore alongside Teddy Atlas rings out. I'm just looking up at the corner here at this guy that just got tagged, Teddy, this fighter who just got stunned. And I'm thinking, boy, it's like the air's come out of him a bit. He looks just so dejected now. Yeah, you know, right now he's on the side of a mountain. You know, he's up on a cliff, and he needs a rope to get down. So that's what you got to do, Joe. You don't look and say, hey, he's up on a cliff. We know that. Give him a rope. Give him advice to get down. Tyson's corner did a good job during those 60 seconds between rounds. You can tell that he's a fresh fighter, not the fighter that was clearly dazed in the last round. Look at that combination by Joe Frazier. Nice, nice! Not able to land the headshot.
punches right. together now. That's a nice combination. Off to the side, a little swing and a miss going upstairs. Really on the mark with that overhand left. Don't stay in one spot. Many great athletes are associated with a specific city. You think Babe Ruth, you think the Bronx. You think Joe Frazier, you think a Philly fighter. You think about wars, you think about pain. You think about a fighter that brings it every second. You think about Joe Frazier. And coming upon the halfway mark of this three-minute round. <laughs> a shooting right hand by Mike Tyson. Tyson's just punching air that time. His opponent was able to get out of the way. A fierce left hand that landed by Mike Tyson. Well targeted two punch combo by Joe Frazier. Takes one, gives one. The right hand scores well. Frazier's gonna feel that. Two good, solid hooks to the body land against him. He got a lot into that uppercut. Nice work by Joe Frazier. Double jab right to the face. Blocks the headshot. He scored well after being hit himself. Combination punching is working well here. Tyson's hurt from that. Shake it off. And there's the bell. He is saved by the bell. Oh boy, Teddy, he's in a world of hurt now. Only 60 seconds. It's been 60 seconds. It took him five seconds to get him on that stool. So right now, they can't concentrate just on telling him things, and he needs to be told why he got hit. But they got to get ice on him, and they got to, right now, they have to revive him. Okay, you're okay. Keep your hands up. Keep them up, all right? I mean, you know, he caught you with your hands down. Let's keep them up. Listen, he's going to come forward this round, all right? Keep that jam moving. Keep him away from you, all right? Look him. So a fresh round is underway. But is it a fresh fighter? Tyson's corner is hoping so. Based on what we saw at the end of the last round, who knows? Well, his corner should also be hoping that his opponent across the way doesn't come out here like the executioner to get this over with. Because if he does, I think it's over. He's got head moving. Two good jabs by Joe Frazier. He's got his guard up really well that time, and it protects his head. Very accurate two-punch combo by Joe Frazier. Place body shot again. Keep Scores with the combo to the head. A well placed left hand up top. That's a Big, big shot he just scored with. And why did he score? Because he created range, created distance, created a hole, and he filled that hole. Do that 